we're alive. Do a couple dips off this thing. Oh. Imagine you fell over though. What's going on guys, Carl here, back with another episode from the World Cup. We have now switched to Monaco. We're actually near my place down here in the south of France. We've got a very cool vid. It is the top tech, or the tech that you need to bring to the World Cup, which I actually did, where we've got two pieces on today's episode. So the first piece you may have seen from my tech travel pack, this is the 70 to 200 2.8 G Master. That is a mouthful. This is the greatest super zoom telephoto lens for a Sony system. It just has, I guess, two downsides. The first thing is of course the price, $2,600 for this. It's almost as expensive as gold. It could be, I wonder if we could trade this for a gold bar Ooh. here. At the Chino. <laughs> At the Chino. And bet it all on red. All on red, yes, exactly. But if you are native Sony, of course, I'm recording with the A7R 3 Fits perfectly, that means the autofocus is great. But the second thing, which I don't think is good, is the weight, which I mentioned. It's a heavy, heavy lens. Wow, look at those things. I could almost bicep curl this thing. I don't know if I'd wanna travel with this guy all the time. I think it's great for studio use, but if you're trying to be lightweight, if you only have one backpack, we both complained how heavy this bad boy is. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> if you can look past those two things, since it's got a constant f2.8 aperture, it stays buttery smooth throughout the range. Whether you're super zooming, you can use this as a portrait lens. All of my Instagram shots out here have been taken with this guy. When I was using this to take footage at the World Cup, it felt like I was almost at pitch side how close I could get zoomed in. When you've got that paired with a full frame cam with APS-C crop, you get 1.5 times the focal range, which means you get around 85, 90 to maybe 250 mils of zoom. So from all that footage, I've been using this guy for a ton. It survived the test of time. It survived being in the craziest World Cup game. It's made out of metal. It is waterproof or water resistant. It's sealed. It did get a ton of beer actually spilled on it. It might be a tad bit sticky, but still works perfectly fine. And maybe my favorite feature of this guy has to be the buttery smooth zoom ring. When you're scrolling between 70 to 200, it keeps everything razor sharp and in focus. Here are of course some shots from out here in Monaco, some of the yachts. I tried to get some of the dopest footage, and of course let me know what you guys think down below. to the second piece of tech, which is almost the exact opposite. This is the LG G7 Thin Q. And the reason why I brought this is I had the camera with obviously the 70 to 200. I wanted an ultra wide camera. This is one of the only smartphones now that still has that option for the secondary lens. Most cameras of course have the secondary portrait lens and this guy kind of keeps true and is perfect, I think, for recording in stadiums, for somewhere where you're very tight knit and to get the overall view, which I think is exactly what you needed in the World Cup. We got all the hecticness, the craziness, and the crazy Mexican fans going nuts with this guy. <laughs> Mexico! 
into ultra wide photography and you just need one smartphone, you don't want a dedicated GoPro, you don't want a dedicated lens on your camera, I think this is the only option that you can look for now and it's dope. We're here in the south of France for a couple more days. Let me know if you guys want to see a possible house condo tour. I know my other one did really well. If you guys want to see that, once again, let me know down below in the comments and I will catch the rest of you in one of my next episodes or vlogs. Peace. He wants me to be on TV. Maybe he owns one of those yachts. Maybe we can he get does. maybe we can get onto one of those yachts. What are you gonna do to get on there? I'll sell this lens. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Sony. <Yeah. laughs>